Well, I haven't been gone too long. Hopefully, it is 9.45. And that's the time I used to always say, hey, something's going to happen at 9.45. Have faith, Josh. 10, 9.45. And I, I did figure a few things out from that. But then it kind of... I think it wore itself out. And it was done and dusted. But this is brand new. This is like a brand new thing. Hey, look at this. 444. Four, four. The geezers of Wyoming. This is a geezer anticipation of Jaten. That's what this is. Jaten is anticipating the next major eruption of Wyoming's steamboat geezer. Will happen at 4.58 a.m. Mountain Daylight Time on Saturday, 25th of May, 2019 which is tomorrow. And this will be the sixth, if it happens, it will be the sixth month in a row that the steamboat geyser has erupted on the 25th of the month. And this is a geyser that doesn't go off very often, usually, and it's sporadic, to say the least. So to be hitting the 25th every month is really strange. Jaten is 46. It's the value of his name. Yes, really strange. Steamboat geezer. And the last time it hit the 25th, it hadn't erupted since the 8th. So there was a fairly long delay, 17 days. And then this eruption, the 25th, bang, on the 25th. So it kept this thing going, which began on Christmas Day last year. So the 25th, 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 25th. And is there going to be another one on the 25th? Well, yeah. I think so. Jaten and Demas are identical twins age 16. And their birthday is the 6th. So, September 6th. 16 twos are 32. Two boys age 16. 16 twos are 32. And you know what else adds up to 32? Nathan's life path number is 32 because the digits in his date of birth add up to 32. 1 and 2 is 5, so Nathan's life path number is 5. So that makes me think, well, 5 will do it. It's gone off 5 times in a row on the 25th. 5 fives are 25. That's pretty neat, especially when you think about, you know, all the symbolism to do with that five points and this point pointing up bringing the energy up up into the sky from down below up up the only way is up steamboat geezer so the angel and the demon seem to be cooperating for some reason some purpose what could it be? Well, let's go back to the Giza Times, the main page. 133, the value of Wetterling, 133, the Old Faithful. It went off an hour and 33 minutes ago. The steamboat went off three days, 14 hours and 26 minutes ago. Wow. God equals 26. And Angelic equals 51. Demon also equals 51. Wetterling, 133. Mirror Boy, 133. 133 is also the value of the boy Nathan. Okay, so what's going on now with our temperatures and stuff? Oh, we're still on the radar. The Melbourne Loop. Well, we'll leave the radar. Or actually, we might look a bit wider on the radar. How's that? The 512. It's going to be a little bit slower now because I'm... No, it sh no, it won't. No, it shouldn't be. It shouldn't be. I was going to say I'm uploading. I'm not. I'm not uploading. 24th of the 5th, 2019 is today. That's the rain radar of Victoria. And that's where Nathan's from. He was from King Lake West near Melbourne. But he was also familiar with Darwin because he went to Darwin a lot. And I know that from reading, you know, 
stuff that his family have written, and surviving family. Mount Papandian equals 126. And yes, there is a connection to Mount Papandian. Symbolically. Not literally, not physically, not literally. Not causally. There's no connection to the Steamboat Geezer because these are on opposite sides of the planet. But symbolically, there's a connection. 2,666 meters. Twins. Twins, Papandayan and Puntang. And the Steamboat Geezer, well, it also has twins. And a lot of symbolism. A lot of weird stuff, you might say. But yeah, twin vents. Twin vents of Steamboat Giza. Kind of like a dragon's nostrils breathing out hot water and steam. So that's the connection. The first thing I connected to these two. Plus the, the name Norris. Norris Giza Basin. Norris equals 93. It has a value of 93. As does Papandian. 93. And Puntang. 93. The twins have the same value. A reflection of angels. Angel. Angel. Yes, so volcanoes. The ring of fire. I fell down in a burning ring of fire. I went down, down, down. And the flames went higher. And it burns, burns, burns. The ring of fire. The ring of fire. Indonesia is on the ring of fire. Jake Westling died on the 22nd of October, 1989. And Nathan Breeze died in 2009. Reflections. No causal connections, but lots of reflections. The beauty of elfin woodland. Jaten likes that. He likes that description. Elfin woodland. Three minutes ago, Old Faithful went off. Old Faithful went off. It erupted. That's why it's called Old Faithful. It's not like some of the others. Steamboat is unpredictable. Completely unpredictable. And doesn't go off. I mean, it doesn't go off. It doesn't go off often, but it also doesn't go off predictably. It's very unpredictable. That's what I'm trying to say. Samuel Delaney, 137. Mount Papandzian, 127. Six. This is kind of weird. The Dark Tower, 148. The Dark Tower, 6, 6. Twin equals 6, 6. The Dark Tower twin. Samuel Delaney, the name Samuel, is 137. King Lake West is 137. That's where Nathan's life ended. King Lake West. Mount Papadayan, 126. I can see something here. 16. 4 4 is a 16. Jayton is 16. Yeah. See, 137 days after Nathan died, the value of King Lake West, Samuel was born. Samuel. Anyway. Twins. Twins aged 16, that would be Jaten and Demas, or Demas and Jaten, whatever way you want to say it, doesn't really matter. 16 times 2 is 32. So, life path number. Add up the digits in your date of birth, and you get your life path number, eventually. The digital root is the life path number. Nathan's life path number is 5. Three twos are six. The boy Jaten, born on the sixth of the ninth. Turn nine on its head and you get six. Red Rain is sixty-nine. Boy Jack Chambers. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. The Dark Tower. Twin, because Jake is described as having blonde hair, blue eyes, just like the twins in Red Rain. And Samuel Delaney, twin Samuel. Twin Samuel is one three seven. Twin Samuel, Daniel and Samuel, the 12-year-old twins in Red Rain. 6 plus 6 is 12. They're identical twins. The Mirror Boy, 
is 166. Bad Mirror Boy is 140. And this is where it gets weird. If we go back to Giza Times, six minutes ago, Old Faithful went off. And Steamboat, well, we have to go back to around here, 2002. Yeah, around here. Around here, Friday the 26th of April, 2002. At 10 p.m., there was an eruption. And that set the scene for something. 140 days later, Bad Mirror Boy, 140. Friday the 13th of September, 2002. This eruption was exactly a week after Jaten was born. Jaten and Demas. Look, 20 and its reflection, 02. 10, 10 20 p.m. or 22 20. 20. Just that extra 20 minutes. As if to say, hey, remember me. Remember the 20. So Jaten was born exactly a week before this eruption. Jaten and Demas. Okay. Red Rain Boy Jack Chambers reflect the real message. The real message. Jack Chambers is 96. Steamboat, Destiny of the Boy, Alun Alun, 16. Alun Alun. The crater. The main crater of Mount Papandzian. And Puntang. Don't forget Puntang. So tomorrow. There's a sign. Would you say it's a sign? An oracle? A message? Something. Jayton, age 16. And Nathan would be aged 23 now. Add them together, you get 39. The value of candle. Candle is 39. We can catch up next Thursday at 1pm. These were Jayton's words to me in my dream on Thursday, 25th of April, 2019. Was he pranking me? Or was he riddling me? on Anzac Day morning. What do you reckon? Pranking? Riddling? Is there a difference? Yes. There is a difference. Usually. Nine minutes ago, Old Faithful erupted. Hmm. Three days, 14 hours and 35 minutes since the steamboat erupted. It's 5.58, Friday 24th of May 2019. Hey, 58 past, that's the time. It's going to be 58 past 4. So we're 11 hours away. Is that right? No, because it's not that soon. It's not p.m., it's a.m. So it's 23 hours away. Does that sound right? Yeah, 4.58 would be 23 hours away. 23, Nathan would be 23 now, if, he's, if he were here, but he's not here. 24 is his birthday, the 24th of November, but it's reflected today, Friday, the 24th of May. So I was thinking, hey, it makes sense if it's today. But then the reflections are like, reflections get confusing. Dragon is 59, the fire dragon. Candle. We can catch up next Thursday at 1pm. So this gave me the tool to work it out. Not just the tool, it gave me the base, the start point to work it out. Because without this I couldn't have done it. I would have been lost. Like Casper the ghost just floating around in Wyoming. Floating around like a bit of mist. Six, it's nearly six o'clock, see, in Wyoming, in Casper. So maybe Casper gets caught in the mist from the steamboat Giza. Floats around in the sky. Like a cloud. I'd say that's what happens. Six. Two plus four is six. The devil's number. The devil's number. The number of what exactly is the devil? Well, depends. Everyone's got a different idea. No one knows. No one knows anything. Nobody knows anything. It's all mysterious. Once you go on the other side of death, 
Nobody knows anything. It's all a mystery. That's the truth. It's a mystery. It's a great big fat mystery. So these were Jason's words to me in my dream on Thursday 25th of April 2019. Anzac Day is like Remembrance Day for those who allegedly chose to die violently. In my next dream on my birthday, which was two days later, there had been some kind of car accident and Jayton was definitely one of my, the attending healers. I could feel his good energy radiating from him. Kind, loving energy. Different to the first dream where Jayton was a bit, I don't know, a bit, uh, I don't know. Braddy's not the right word, but something. In my next dream on my birthday, there had been some kind, oh, I've read that. Jayton is turning 17 on Friday 6th of September 2019. That's Jayton's birthday, along with Demas's birthday. Jayton constantly reminds me he was born first. So I'm guessing he meant next Thursday as in the Thursday after the 17th major eruption of his steamboat. His steamboat. Not Demas's, his steamboat. They argue over it. His clue seemed cryptic as a crossword puzzle, and yet it turned out to be simple and logical. Cryptic as a crossword puzzle. Hmm. Where are we? One 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 seventeen. Eruption one eighteen. Nine six. Steamboat equals ninety six. Jayton born on the sixth of the ninth. Thirteen. It's thirteen minutes since Old Faithful erupted. What's going on with temperatures and winds in Australia? No changes. No changes. Bad Mirror Boy one forty. Mount Papandzian one two six. True. The word true equals 64, and so does American. American is 64. I guess this is an American prediction, except I'm Australian. It's about an American geezer, so we're going to have to fight about it. The Mirror Boy, 166. The Mirror Boy. The Mirror Boy. So, the 17th eruption of the steamboat was... 3.23 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time on Monday, 20th of May, 2019. That's the most recent eruption of the Steamboat Giza. So, 140. Haha. <laughs> Bad Mirror Boy, 140. There it is, 3.23 in the afternoon. Monday, the 20th of May, 2019. The morning after I was filming the pond, which is a bit weird. I went outside at 3 o'clock in the morning and filmed the moon in the water, which was a bit strange, but I did. So, there's the last one that happened on the 25th. There's been a few since then. It's got into a bit of a rhythm since then. So, if, if it goes off tomorrow, it'll be, well, I'll show you in a sec. In a sec. Soon. Soon I will show you. Can I go back to where I was that way? Oh yeah, I can. How cool. Hmm. Well, well, well. He's a handsome devil. Handsome devil. And he's sending the energy upwards. Well, that's interesting. Oh, what's the time? I was going to look at the time. Giza times. It gets confusing. Giza times and actual times. Casper. Casper says it's 6.04, Friday, 24th of May, 2019. Casper, the white ghost. Okay. What about somewhere else in Wyoming? We'll take Casper for a little cruise somewhere. Down the Green River? Sounds good. Same time, because it's all the same time zone in Wyoming. It's mountain daylight time. But now we're in Green River. 6.04. Remember, true equals 64. True. Healer. He's a true healer. So it seemed like it was cryptic, yet simple and logical. Kind of paradoxical. The 17th eruption of Steamboat was at 7:23 p.m., which we just looked at. 32:23. 32:23. Reflections can drive you crazy. They can. They can. 
Tell me about it, says Jayton. He's the bad mirror boy. He ought to know about such things. In the wake of his misspent youth. Oh, and that. I needed a clue or a riddle that wasn't just another disorientating cosmic reflection to help me work out the date and time. And Jayton gave me a good one. A good one. Nathan was born on Friday, 24th of November 1995, but his first birthday landed on Sunday, 24th of November 1996. So he's born on a Friday, and his first birthday was on a Sunday. How come his birthday skipped Saturday? Nathan died on Saturday, 7th of February 2009. So no wonder he didn't want his first birthday to be on a Saturday. Black Saturday. Two nines are 18. Nathan would have turned 18 on Sunday 24th of November 2013. You see, 1996 was a leap year. And then 24 years later, 2020 is also a leap year. 2020 is a leap year too. The whole idea was to link the Steamboat Giza to Mount Papandayan, which erupted last, last erupted in 2002. Is there two? Or three. Yeah, triplets kind of helped me with this actually. Because three thirteens are thirty nine. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? Is it a UFO? Is it a dragon? No. No, it's a phoenix. It's a phoenix. It looks like a dragon, but it's not a dragon. Welsh equals sixty seven. Welsh. There's a red dragon on the Welsh flag. Did you know? There is. A Welsh dragon on the Welsh flag. Phoenix equals 91. Mirror. Exciting water spirit. Breeze boy's miracle. It's 61. A reflection, see? Phoenix. Breeze. The phoenix comes back. You think it's dead, but it's not. It comes back from the ashes. Two twins. See the... Thursday, Friday, Saturday. On the third day he rose again at 1pm on Saturday. Well, I could have just gone with that. Nah. That would be too easy for a bad Christian lad to figure out. Jayton is an identical twin, so there is bound to be a reflection in reverse. You'd think, how does 1am on Saturday sound then? Nah, that would be still, it'd still be like falling into the pond, face first. Jayton likes to give clues that seem tricky, yet are very simple, if you just open up your heart and feel it. That's where it is. If there's any such thing as psychic, it relates to feelings. Heartfelt, honest feelings, true feelings, emotions. Riddle of a dragon boy spirit. Weird clouds, wetter boy wetterling. Wetterling. Weather child, it's a German surname. In Jake's case, it's German. 13 times 3 is 39. 1 pm Mountain Daylight Time. On Thursday, 23rd of May 2019, 39 hours later, it's 4 am Mountain Daylight Time. On Saturday, 25th of May, 2019. I could have said that'll do. Close enough. But you might as well keep going, Mr. Holmes. I mean, why not? What have you felt from me, Jacob? What have you felt from me? And what have you felt from Nathan? Who is their bad mirror boy? What have you felt from him? It'll come to you eventually. Days, then hours. Just add Angel for days and Nathan for hours. You'll feel it when you've got it right. Eventually you might even get the math right, but I wouldn't count my baby dragons. See Angel and Nathan. 1pm, that was the clue, 1pm. We can catch up on Thursday at 1pm. Next Thursday at 1pm. So 1pm Mountain Daylight Time on Thursday 
23rd of May 2019, which was yesterday, it's now 10.10. 10. 10. 10, 10. 23rd of May was yesterday. Add 39 hours and 58 minutes. The value of Angel and Nathan. And that gives you the time, the exact time, Mountain Daylight Time, on Saturday, 25th of May, 2019. Did I work it out right? I think you may have, actually. Angel Nathan. Angel Nathan. 611. It feels right. Everything feels right. I've been, like, making mistakes constantly, like usual. But it feels right, like something's right. 22, most powerful number in numerology. It just feels right. A feelings is everything. You can make mistakes and all that. Of course, but... Mabinogi. Alun in Welsh means handsome. Did you know this? Handsome. He's a handsome devil. And I'll tell you the rest when I come back. Handsome. A Javanese word, Alun Alun, the name of the volcano crater of Mount Papandayan. But in Welsh, it has another meaning, handsome. How weird is that? Well, pretty weird. 142 and 124. Man, I've got to go. This is weird, actually. Quite weird. Anyway, I've got to go. Do something. So I'll be back. Giza times. 23. Nathan's current age is 23. Jaten aged 16. Bad boy equals 49. Bad boy. Bad boy. He's a bad boy. 6-12. Two sixes are 12. The twins are 12, Daniel and Samuel, in Red Rain. I'll be back.